Okay guys, we're uh, getting the panels up on the walls and uh, <clears throat> thought we would explain to people what we're doing is when this is all finished, we want it to look like sheetrock, textured sheetrock in a house. So these are all going to get primed and textured and painted and when it's all done, the screw holes will all be spackled in and it'll, be, it'll look like sheetrock in a house, but it'll be this it's quarter inch birch plywood. So uh, maybe I'll stop a question by saying the only reason we chose the birch plywood is because the same price as AB fir plywood, which is much harder to sand and finish than this is. So we could get hardwood plywood for the same price as softwood plywood. So we got the hardwood stuff. Um, in the end, when we're all done, there's going to be a chase that goes up here that the uh, all the wires go in. Yeah, here's a mock-up of that. So this is going to be in between the ceiling and the walls. And the 12 volt wiring is going to run in there. The uh, mini split lines are going to run through there. Anyhow, if we ever have a problem or need to repair this, we can just pull these screws out and then remove these panels. And we're going to prime them on both sides. Uh, to help keep the plywood even more dimensionally stable so it doesn't try to warp because it's only painted on one side. And we've left a gap at the bottom intentionally and at the top so that the panels can shrink and swell without being a problem either. So that's what we're doing, we're on it. So yeah, we're back in the bedroom area. So this- Oh, and the Murphy bed's all built in now. Yeah. You can kind of see that. What's up, YouTube? You gotta love that. It's gonna look so cool. And then uh, these aren't screwed up yet, but when these are screwed up, there'll be a, a trim piece up here too. So that'll get covered up. And the middle here is gonna get covered up with the seam uh, or with a piece of trim. So, so it's exciting. It's starting to come together, people. Yeah. Mama is very happy today. Don't worry, people, it's just a starter hole. <laughs> What's up? Make sure you get one of them down cut blades if you're doing the hardwood, plywood, and then turn your rocker switch off. We were chipping all over until we turned off the rocker and got the right blade in. Clean cut now, baby. You know what that's for? Yeah, it's for our window. It's just to get the router right, in. Right, to be able to get the router in so yeah, you can yeah. get the window out. We got it. We got it. What's up, YouTube? <laughs> so let's go see how this guy fits. Oh, man. Are you short? No, you, are no, you on your I forgot we got to put a little notch right here. Oh. <laughs> and we, got, we still got to trim off some of the yeah, or fat. excess foam. We got foam. fat foam. And we got to trim it off. Oh, for the notch right up top. Yeah. But we have some some foam back here that's holding this out. So we gotta clean that off. Okay. Shaving, Miss Mary. Uh-huh. Do we need to go close yeah. to here? Well get your straight edge and you'll see. We need to definitely clean up here. But that's all good. Wire track. Yeah, raceway. So. Man, you gotta love this thing. This was so worth the investment. I think we got it now. Let's see. Yeah, how'd you do that? Ha! 
How did I do that? Oh, well, the race, the raceway is going to cover that. Anyway. Well, you were in charge of doing the measuring. What are you looking for? Tape measure. We cut it 83. I wonder why we did that. You're the one that marked and measured. <laughs> I have some words for you, but this is child-friendly <laughs> channel. Yeah, but like you said, I bet the raceway will cover it up. Oh, yeah. Piece of cake? The raceway has to come yeah. down like that. Yeah. It's up in there. It's inch, up in there. So. Easy. So we can actually, we can pick it up right there to close uh -huh. it. Okay, super. So everybody that doesn't know, the router's gonna, the ball bearing's gonna go on the window sill and it's gonna trim that right to the side we want it. That's my favorite part. I was gonna say, woohoo, we have a window! That is cool, honey. Yeah, it's messy though. There's a smaller tool for doing that that contractors use, but this will work if this is what you got. Oh, YouTube, we're grilling lights today. <laughs> and so we've located where we wanna put our recessed LED lights. And so we're drilling in the holes. And I've also got um, the back shelves all primered. So that is coming together. So we're going to keep putting the walls up. And we will just catch you guys in the next one. Love to you all. Bye.